Assalamualaikum and welcome to another video on ECG. I am Dr. Wajid. I have done residency in cardiology and I am currently working at Shifa International Hospital as a registrar. This is the ECG which we are going to discuss today. Aaj ki ECG is very interesting hai ke is tarah ki finding hum generally routine mein bahut kam dekhte hain. As usual, discussion shuru karne se pehle, I would like you to pause your video, note down the findings and diagnosis with yourself and at the end of the video, compare your findings and diagnosis with what was discussed in this ECG. As usual, pehli cheez jo hum ECG pe dekhte hain, it is rhythm. Rhythm ke liye lead to ya rhythm strip dekhte hain. As you can see that in this ECG, there is upright and prominent P wave before each QRS complex. So this is a sinus rhythm. Next thing is heart rate. Heart rate ke liye hum ek aisa QRS complex select karenge which lies on broad line. Or us QRS complex or next QRS complex ke dharmiyan hum large boxes ko count karenge as 300, 150, 100, and 75. So, the second QRS, it lies between 100 and 75. So, likely the heart rate is around 80 to 85. Heart rate ke baad, jo next is hum dekhte hain, ECG mein, it is axis. Axis ke liye hum lead 1 or lead AVF ko dekhte hain. Lead 1 mein the direction of QRS complex is downwards. While in case of AVF, the QRS complex is isoelectric. That is the R wave is equal to S wave in amplitude. So this is basically right axis deviation. Iske baad agar aap lead 1 or lead AVL mein note kare, to P wave inverted hain. While P waves are upright in lead AVR. Similarly, the R wave in lead 1 in AVL is negative while it is positive in AVR. In normal circumstances, the P wave in lead 1 in AVL is upright while it is negative in lead AVR. Similarly, the QRS complex in lead 1 and AVL are positive while they are negative in AVR. So, when you see this ECG, dekhen, to, there could be two differential diagnoses. One is limb lead reversal and other is dextrocardia. If we differentiate karne ke liye, hum chest lead, ko chest leads mein agar aap dekhen, to, there is a prominent R wave in lead V1. Iske baad, uh, the amplitude of uh, R wave decreases from V1 to V6. Normal ECG, if you remember, the R wave in lead 1 is small or minimal and after that the R wave increase in amplitude from V2 to V6. So, this type of ECG with inverted P waves in lead 1 AVL and uh, positive P wave in QRS complex in lead AVR and there are uh, the R wave decreases in amplitude from V1 to V6 it means that there is dextrocardia dextrocardia hota kya hai pehli cheez to ye ke the heart lies on the right side of the chest secondly the left atrium and left ventricle they lie on the right side of RV and RA a core condition hoti hai jisko hum kehte hain dextroversion in case of dextroversion the heart lies on the right side of the chest while the LA and LV they are present on the left side of RA and RV. So this is all for today. Umeed hai aapko aaj ki ECG pasand hai hogi. For more videos please subscribe to our channel and stay tuned. Thank you very much.